Hey everybody, Randy here. So I wanted to talk to you a little bit. A few weeks ago, I did a video about my first impressions with the Infinity Targets. So in that video, I mentioned that I was gonna be torture testing this target to see if it lived up to the 110 rounds per square inch guarantee. So I shot this target with 93 rounds of nine millimeter, 147 grain full metal jacket through my Chris Vector. Um, you can see in the following video where I did some shooting, so we added some fun for you there. Hope you enjoyed the shooting. So we're back here. Um, I wanted to give full disclosure before we look at the target and see what happened. So full disclosure, I ordered these Infinity targets back on three on March 18th. So on March 18th, I placed the order. They were supposed to be here within 10 days. They did not arrive. Um, I was tracking my UPS. UPS said that they lost the package. So I contacted Infinite Defense and they sent out a new package on March 30th. So on March 30th, they sent out a new package, which was two targets and uh, two clips. So to hold the targets up. So I didn't get the targets until April 4th. So we're looking at about a three week span. It took me to actually get the targets rather than the 10 days that they originally kind of say on their website. So I was a little disappointed with that. Um, what ended up happening is UPS actually found the package. And so uh, they brought it to my house uh, instead of returning it to Infinite Defense. So I actually got two orders for the price of one. So let's break that down. My original order was $234 for two targets and two clips to hold the targets. I used a discount code that got me $40 off and it came to $213 after tax for two targets and two clips. What I've got in total because of UPS's mistake is four targets and four clips for $213. When I contacted Infinite Defense initially, when I asked them, you know, like, hey, where's these targets, that sort of thing, they said, don't worry, UPS insures us so you don't have to worry about us eating the loss. We'll send some new ones out to you. It didn't you know, make me feel better because I was hoping to use them earlier on a few range trips and I ended up having to wait you know, nearly a month for these targets to arrive. So 
I didn't get the warm and fuzzies from customer service at Infinite Defense. Uh, and then it gets more interesting. So let's, let's get into the target and then we'll talk about what happened because I did contact Infinite Defense as well. All right, everybody. So here's the target. Did it hold up? The answer is no. So we placed 93 rounds roughly in this area and there's a hole that's about an inch and a half, like kind of a triangle here that you can see, I'll push my finger through here there we go. So there's a hole in this, a significant hole. And it's kind of something that I noticed in my original video is when I used 9mm, it was taking larger chunks out of the back, obviously, than the faster 223 556. So the diameter of the bullet is really what matters on these targets. Um I contacted Infinite Defense. So now here's the other part. I contacted Infinite Defense. And I asked them about, you know, what's this guarantee? How are things holding up? That sort of thing. Infinite Defense told me their targets are guaranteed for 110 rounds of 5.56 per square inch. I shot this with, there's no way that I stacked all 93 rounds in a square inch. So less than 93 rounds of 9mm in the square inch. Well within their guarantee. Infinite Defense said... That's close enough. They weren't going to honor any guarantee with that. And in fact, the customer service rep pointed out, well, you already got two targets for free. So I, I'm a little burned by it, needless to say, because let's say UPS would have returned those, those two targets to infinite defense. It still sounds like they wouldn't have honored the guarantee that they post on their website. So I know that these have gotten a really popular you're starting to see them at industry events. You're starting to see them on Instagram, things like that. But could you imagine if you paid $213 for what effectively accounts like, you know, a, a decent end, you know, gym floor mat, or if you're from the Midwest, you know, like a, a barn, a barn mat, a barn padding, that sort of thing. Um, we use mats like this, you know, in cow stalls and things like that in the Midwest. But it's not like it's, you know, space age, te space age technology or anything like that. It's just a rubber mat. And they charge $213 for two of them with two clips that you could buy at Home Depot for, you know, like 3 or $4. So with them not honoring their guarantee and the customer service that I've got so far, I can't recommend using these. Um, they're, it, it's really hard to justify using these when people throw out boxes every day. I get Amazon packages, you get Amazon packages, everyone gets Amazon packages. There's a ton of cardboard that's readily available for people to shoot at. There's paper for people to shoot at. These aren't coming with stands or anything like that. So in my honest opinion, I don't think anyone should be buying these targets. Uh, it just doesn't make financial sense. They're not feasible. If they're not doing the guarantee, it, it didn't last up to one you know range day of mine and I'm just a normal guy. Now imagine if you're running a class with 10 guys that are shooting all at the same time. There's no way these things live up to their guarantee or that they last one, one course. So um, it just doesn't make sense. If they were at a price point, let's say $20 a target, $25 a target, that might be feasible. But at pretty much $100 a target, it's not even close to feasible. Uh, you should be getting five sheets for that price. Um, so yeah, overall summary here, if you're a normal person, if you don't have some crazy freebies that they're giving out to you or anything like that, I would stay away from these infinity targets. Uh, either they're gonna have to come up down in price or they're gonna have to make better mats because they don't live up to the 110 round per square inch guarantee that they post all over their website, all over their social media, and everything else. Thanks for watching, everyone. Uh, if you have a comment, please, free feel, please feel free to leave it. Um, thumbs up the video, thumbs down the video, however you felt, I'd love to hear it. Hope you enjoy the new lighting, the new camera, that sort of thing. Looking forward to bringing you guys better content down the road. All right, thank you. Take care.